There's an absolute revolution occurring in the suburbs around Perth, indeed around Australia and the world. It's something that brings people together to socialise, whilst doing one of the most rewarding things a person can do, growing edible plants and sharing the rewards of the harvest. The town of Victoria Park has an absolute ripper, one Mayor Trevor Vaughan is very proud of. Oh, it's hugely important for our residents because we do have people who don't have big backyards to be able to grow produce. It means community people can come together and talk about growing and they come here, they grow their produce. They are a group of people that really want to see something in the community forge ahead. The garden is located in Reed Park. Now it's in a beautiful sunny spot in the park and this was once just lawn area that needed to be maintained by council. Today it is a thriving oasis of edible plants. There are all sorts here and some of the plots have some real interesting collections like this here. Now you can see it's been used all the time. It is a wonderful lime basil. It smells amazing and these plants here, peanuts. Harvesting your own peanuts, what a great idea. And over here is a ripper. This is a very unusual plant. It's called the rosella. It's a form of hibiscus, and the buds are absolutely delicious. Chris Sidaway is the chairperson of the garden. Now, Chris, this is a fantastic garden. You guys have done a great job. How many people are involved? Probably about 50 all up, mm -hmm. um, in a variety of roles. Uh, we have some who are just members only. They didn't want any plots, but they come on a voluntary basis. And they also come to the Sunday Club. When people join and get a plot, they have certain responsibilities that they adhere to. So they adopt a fruit tree, and that's their job to look after that, learn right. how to uh, deal with all the problems that come with it. People share their knowledge, um, tips on how to treat the bugs. And so it's an all round sharing of knowledge. I just love the idea of community gardens, mainly because they're a place where you can meet like-minded people, share ideas and learn together. It's not about being a garden expert, it's about celebrating the harvest together. <laughs>